Well, I founded the band Pansy Division to be the first out gay rock band, and this is back in 91. There were so many people who thought, oh, there's plenty of gay rock stars. Nobody was out. It seemed like you could do anything in pop music except be gay. I'd love to lure to my room. We'll lay back. So I thought, I'm going to start a gay rock band that will be completely out and completely blunt and won't worry about assimilationist people who say, oh, uh, you gay people, if you want acceptance, you should just be on your best behavior and not push the envelope. We push the envelope. I love to run my hand through his long and wavy locks and be stretched out on his bed holding one another's cocks. As soon as the first album came out, we start getting letters from teenagers in Alabama who say, I love your music, but I'm hiding your records from the rest of my family, and I can't wait till I move away and I'm able to come out. I heard you're getting married. It's inevitable to me. I tend to listen to KALW when I'm in my kitchen. Uh, my favorite shows uh, include Les Show with Harry Shearer, Sound Opinions, The Rock Critics Show, This American Life. I'll listen to Fresh Air on KALW2. I like a lot of the local shows, like Out in the Bay, Cross Currents, Your Call with Rose Aguilar. I like the combination of the national shows and the local shows. I'm John Ginoli, and KALW is my source for in-depth programming that's both entertaining and informative. <laughs>